Hello guys, this code is back from the Guild of Near Protocol Philippines ay nagbabalik for another video and another chapter for Learn Near. Um, kung saan tayo mga matututo at makapag-earn ng Near. And tayo ngayon ay nandito na sa chapter uh, at ang title nito ay How much does it cost to use Near? Uh, ito ay tinatawag na gas, gas fee kung tawagin ka. Uh, kung natanda nyo sa aming previous video, makikita nyo sa aming channel, which is Near Protocol Philippines. Uh, then, maaari kayong mag-subscribe at mag-like then na aming mga videos. At then, maaari kayong matuto more about Near Protocol cryptocurrencies, DeFi, DAO, and NFTs. Yan. At maaari rin kayo pumasok sa aming Medium account, aming Twitter, Facebook page, Facebook group, and our Telegram channel. At meron na rin pala kami Discord channel at Fed Marie Gays Mindon mapag-usapan more about Near Protocol Philippines and Cryptocurrency and Blockchain Technology. Yan. So, magsisimula na tayo ngayon ito sa next chapter natin at ang title nito. How much does it cost to use Near or Gap? When you make calls to the Near blockchain to update or change data, the people running the infrastructure of the blockchain incur some cost. At the end of the day, some computer somewhere process your request and validators running this computer spend significant capital to these computers running. Like other programmable blockchains, Near compensates these people by charging transaction fees, also, gas, also called gas fees. So, it is yes, sabi ko na. Kada transaction na gumagawa tayo sa cryptocurrency or sa blockchain, ay meron tayo, minihingan tayo ng transaction fees na tinatawag rin natin gas fee. Yun. If you're familiar with Web2 cloud service providers, Amazon Web Services, Google Cloud, etc. A big difference with blockchain is that users get charged immediately when they make a call to an app rather than developers fronting the cost of using all that infrastructure. Uh, same with Amazon Web Service and Google Cloud. Kada may kumagawa tayo ng call sa mismo app. At iniingan tayo ng, ng isang bayad sa paggamit ng infrastructure na yun. This creates new possibilities such as apps that have no long-term risk of going away due to developer or company funds running out. <coughs> Excuse me. However, it also comes with some usability speed bumps. To help with this, Near also provides the ability for developers to cover gas costs for users to create a more familiar experience to those coming from Web2. Uh, sabi dito, uh, uh, ng long risk uh, going away due to developer funds na nauubos. Kaya dito, dito pumapasok mismo yung, dito tumutulong yung Near para makapag-provide ng developer para makover yung gas cost para sa mga user para magkaroon ng to create more and more familiar experience to those coming from Web2 uh, when thinking about gas keep two concepts in mind gas units internally transaction fees are not calculated directly in your tokens but instead go through an in-between pace of gas units the benefit of gas units is that they are deterministic that the same transaction will always cost the same number of gas units um, dito nung sa gas units uh, iisa lang yung 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 bayad depende sa, sa basta same cost lang siya ng gas units uh, hindi na ba bago yun uh, gas price gas units are then multiplied by a gas fee price to determine how much to charge users this price is automatically recalculated each block depending on network demand a previous block is more than half full price goes up otherwise it goes down and it won't charge by more than one percent each block and bottoms out at a price that's configured by the network currently 100 million yokton near note the gas price can differ between years mainnet and testnet check the gas price before relying on the numbers below um, kada kada nangyayari transaction uh, yung gas units ito ito kada kada bilang ng yeah, kada bilang kada create natin ng transaction sa near na nag-ibay yung gas unit at nag-ibay yung gas gas fee doon na de-depende kung magkano yung babayaran natin sa gas units uh, thinking in gas near as a more or less one second block time 
accomplished by limiting the amount of gas per block, the gas units have been carefully calculated to work to some easy to take in numbers. 10 raised to 12 gas units or 20 tera gas equals 1 millisecond of compute time. So, sa 10 raised to 12 na gas units or sa 1, 1 tera gas, uh, 1 millisecond yung pag send yung transaction time which at a minimum gas price of 400 million yokton year equals a 0 point million year charge yun sa ito yung mismo sa isang 100 million yokton year ang mabibilang alang natin ng na gas fee ay 0 point 1 dito makikita na na tawag nun na mababa lang yung gas fee this 1 ms is a rough but useful approximation and is the current goal of how gas fee units are set within here. So, ganito na si set kung paano gumagana yung, yung gas units and gas fees in here. Gas units is enca encapsulate not only compute CPU time but also bandwidth network time and storage IO time. Via governance mechanism, system parameters can be tweaked, shifting the mapping between T gas and milliseconds in the future. But the above is still a good starting point for TK about what gas units mean and where they get, where they come from. So meron tayo sa sagotan. Quiz 1. 1 tera gas or T gas is equal to, syempre, uh, valid, valid base dito ang sagot, syempre, 1 millisecond of time. So, the cost of common actions to give you a starting point for what to expect for cost and here the table below is some common actions of how much T gas they currently require and what the fee would be in millionaire at the gas price of 100 million um anong basa dun? Uh, yokton here yung palabasa dito yokton here operation T gas fee so sa so pag create ng account ang transaction gas ay 0 0.42 at the fee nito, um, what is this MN? A millionaire. Um, ang millionaire nito ay 0 0.042. At ang transaction fee nito sa near ay 4 times 10 raised to negative 5. Yun yun. Sa send pan sa man ay 0.45. At sa millionaire naman ay 0 0.045. At yun. 4.5 times 10 raised to negative 5 as sa stake naman sa pag stake ang um, T gas ay 0 0.50 at ang um, P ng ng millionaire ay 0 0.050 at ang P in there ay 0 0.0 times 10 raised to negative 5 at full access key ay 0 0.42 and 0 0.042 then 4 point times 10 raised to negative 5. Ang delete key naman ay 0.41. Ang linear ay 0 point, 0 0.041. 4 point 1 time, times 10 raised to negative 5. So, ito yung pinakikita. Ito yung mismo uh, calculations na pinakikita sa, sa pag-create ng transaction. Hindi nyo sa near. Kung titignan nyo naman, hindi ganun kamahal. Actually, hindi talaga siya ganun kamahal. Dahil, kung titignan mo lang, centavos lang yan in peso. In Philippine peso. Centavos lang yan. Kada trade ng transactions in here, uh, I mostly make transactions on here because, syempre, marami kami tinutulungan na, na people who joins in Paras. So, we sometimes lend them NIRs, tokens, and and me and my friends who who also I invite them to use and invest in near we also transact using our near tokens kaya kaya nakikita ko na mababa talaga yung presyo ng near unlike nagta-transfer ka ng ethereum and bitcoin kapakamahal ng gas fee uh, it takes thousands of pesos sometimes hundreds ang swerte mo na kung nakagastos ka na hundred pesos pag-gastos lang ng gas fee. Dito naman sa near, minsan pinakamataas ko yata na gastos dito ay 
siguro 10 pesos lang ata dahil mataas yung value ng year nun pero dito kung pagkukumpare nyo syempre mas gusto ko na dito sa year dahil mura yung gas fee at ang bilis pa unlike nasabi ko nasabi ko naman sa previous video na maba, matagal sa ibang crypto kahit nga USDT sometimes it takes a minute for you to receive it and the transaction from it eh. dito naman sa near seconds lang pinakamatagal na nito one minute kaya ano subo ko na rin tong year at maganda talaga maganda rin yung pag 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 transactions na because of the less fee of gas so dito nagtatapos ang ating chapter na ang title how much does it cost to use near or uh, sa gas when it comes to gas fee sa so sana marami kayo na intindihan kung paano tuma, kung paano ang bilang ng gas fee dito sa near at sana i-like nyo tong video mag-subscribe kayo at at sana sundan nyo pa ang aming susunod na video dito sa Learn Near. Uh, yun lamang po at maraming salamat po.